Hello and welcome to yet another playoff edition broadcast of your San Diego Padres here on the San Diego Padre Radio Network. So we're here at Petco Park and your San Diego Padres need to win. If they don't win today, their season is over. The Nationals have a 2-0 series lead and look to conclude it. Meanwhile, the Padres look to stay alive, but they're going to have a big test in front of them. Max Scherzer on the mound for the Nationals. And the Padres will be sending out the lefty, Corey Lupke. So, what will the two lineups look like? Here they are. Leading off for the Padres, Alcides Escobar, Myers, Kemp, Upton, Middlebrooks, Alonzo, Norris, Jerko, and the pitcher, Corey Lupke. Like I said, they will be going up against Max Scherzer. Meanwhile, the Nationals lineup will be going against this guy, Corey Lupke, who had an even record with a 3.15 ERA. So here we go, Ian Desmond, second batter of the game, 2-2 pitch to him, is hit into right, and that will fall, and that will be a base hit for Ian Desmond and the Nationals first on the game. Next batter, Eric Hosmer up to the plate, 3-1 pitch to him, Loopkey deals, it's low, and Hosmer's gonna take ball four. He goes to first, and all of a sudden, the Nationals have some runners in scoring position. Later on, Bryce Harper up to bat, and just like that, he strikes out. Corey Lupke with the first strikeout of the game. And now an important batter is Wilson Ramos needs to get him out. And he will do just that, getting Wilson Ramos to ground out. And that will do it for the first inning. No damage done. Next inning, Scherzer on the mound. Will Myers on the plate. And Myers, unlike last game, where he hit a home run, is going to strike out. Matt Kemp next batter. Two outs, bases empty. 2-1 pitch, Scherzer deals, and Kemp is hitting this one over to right, but Dozier is going to pick that one up and throw it over to first for the out. So just like Lupke, nothing going. 0-0 here at Petco Park. We will be back after this short break. All right, back at the ballpark here. Top of the second inning, Brian Dozier coming up to the plate here with the bases empty and no outs. 0-2 pitch to him, Lupke deals, and it catches the strike zone. Dozier's not happy, but he is striking out. So, next batter, Ryan Zimmerman up to the plate. 3-1 pitch to him, and did he go? No, he didn't, and that is ball four. So, Zimmerman takes his base as Lupke couldn't get him to swing, and that is a walk. Next batter is Max Scherzer, and he's down. Corey Lupke rolling here into the third inning. We go Bryce Harper up to bat with runners on first and second. 2-2 pitch to Bryce is here. It is hit up the middle. It's cut off by Escobar. Unfortunately, they are not able to convert the double play. They only get one out, so the runners advance. Runners on second and third now for the catcher, Wilson Ramos. 1-1 pitch to him is hit right up the middle. One run will score. The second run is coming around third. He's coming home. The throw is offline. And the Nationals take the 2 to nothing lead. Wilson Ramos with a two-run single. And the Padres are in some trouble. Derek Norris up to the plate in the third. Base is empty. No outs. 2-2 pitch is hit. And Dozier is going to make the catch. So a nice job there by Brian Dozier. He snags that one. And Norris is speechless. Next batter, Jed Jerko. 2-2 pitch coming. And he chases the high fastball. And he is down on strikes. So he strikes out. Corey Lupke, the pitcher, up to the plate. Third inning, 1-2 pitch coming, and he chases the low slider. No, sir, not working for him. Max Scherzer is looking pretty good so far as he is working past this Padres lineup with some ease. Alcides Escobar up to bat in the 4-3-1 pitch is outside, and he takes ball four. So an important base taken there. From Alcides Escobar and Scherzer is not happy. Will Myers up to the plate. Escobar is taking off for second and usually he'll make it. This time an excellent throw comes from Wilson Ramos and they will gun down Harper or sorry Escobar at second. Next batter Matt Kemp. 1-2 pitch is a swing and a miss and the Padres are looking a little shaky here. Season on the line and they're down 2-0 here at Petco. We'll be right back. All right, back at the ballpark. Ian Desmond up to bat here in the fifth inning. Full count coming from Lupke, and that is a high fastball. But Ian Desmond chases it, and he is down on strikes. Next batter, Wilson Ramos. Got a couple of runs earlier. 
but not right now as that one has popped up behind home plate trying to get out of the inning are the Padres with Corey Lupke on the mound and they do just that Norris makes the catch and now we are moving on to the bottom of the fifth Will Middlebrooks up to bat with an out 3-2 pitch coming and Will Middlebrooks hits this one into right it's gonna fall and that will be a single for Will Middlebrooks Tony Gwynn Jr. cannot come up with it and as a result we get a base hit Scherzer not happy. Yonder Alonso up to bat. He takes this one deep into left center. That's going back. Michael Taylor is there, and he will make the catch. So just like last game, Yonder Alonso just a few feet short of a home run. Derek Norris up to the plate now with a runner on first, and the 2-2 pitch is low and away. Norris chases, and that is a strikeout. He's not happy, and it's still 2-0. Sixth inning, Luke Key on the mound, trying to keep his team in the game, and he's doing just that. He gets Ryan Zimmerman, top right corner, and that is a strikeout. So we're bringing in Tommy Medica here to pinch hit for the Padres, hoping to see if he can get something going as we need some base runners. Bottom of the six here, one-two pitch coming from Scherzer to Medica, and he's going to chop that one in front. Can he beat it? Bad play here by Ramos. And they got him at first. Wow, that was questionable. Some miscommunication there led to a late throw, but they said they got him. And we're going to go ahead and challenge this. Bud Black comes out, and he says, you know what? Yeah, we're going to challenge this. Take a second look at this, because I think that Medica was safe. And it was a close call, but I believe he was. And the umps will review it. And after it's all said and done, the call is overturned, and it is a safe play at first. So Medica will be on first with a single and we now have a base runner. I'll see this Escobar, the next batter up to the plate and he'll jack that one into left field. Michael Taylor can make the catch and that is going to send Medica around third. He will come home. Escobar to third. The runner comes home safe. Medica beats out the throw, goes around it and Alcides Escobar has himself an RBI triple. It's 2 on Washington. Kemp up to bat with runners on the corners. It's deep into left, but just hooks foul by a matter of feet. Later in the at bat, Kemp 3 2 pitch coming is low, and he will take ball four. So he didn't get the home run, but he'll take the walk. Scherzer's not happy because guess what? The bases are loaded for Justin Upton, who has not gotten a hit this series. Can he get his first hit this series? Here's the 1-1 pitch. Scherzer deals. Upton hits this one into right center. That will fall. That will roll all the way to the wall. One run is in. Two runs are in. Here comes the third and he is safe. Justin Upton has a three run bases clearing triple and that is going to do it for Max Scherzer's night. The Nationals will bring in Craig Stammen to relieve Scherzer, but the Padres have taken the lead in this crucial do-or-die game. And with Upton at third, Middlebrooks will try to get him home on the sacrifice. Can he do it? Yes, he can. Throw is offline, and now it is 5-2 Padres. They have came up big here in these last few innings, and now we're going to bring in Sean Kelly, whose ERA has come down a considerable amount. Below four, and in the eighth... He's getting Wilson Ramos. A nice strike out there from Kelly. And we just need to allow as little runs as possible. We have a three-run lead. But as we know, that can go away in a hurry. Two outs here in the eighth. Upton chasing it in left. Can he make the catch? Yes, he will. That was a close one, but he makes it. And we are on to the bottom of the ninth. Craig Kimbrell coming in. Can he save the game for the Padres? And can they live to play another game, or will this be it for their season? Here we go. 3-2 pitch to the first batter, Michael Taylor, and he is singling into right field. Camp grabs that one, but there's nothing he can do, and Michael Taylor is aboard first with a single. Next batter, Danny Espinoza, is swinging and missing on the high fastball, and there's one down here in the ninth. Tony Gwynn Jr. up to bat now. 3-2 pitch coming, and that is hit up the middle. Escobar trying to turn the double play. There's one, there's two, and that is it. The San Diego Padres will live to play another game, and wow, that is all you can say is wow. It looked like they were in some deep trouble early as Max Scherzer was dealing, but then a couple of base runners later, they get the bases loaded. Justin Upton with that huge bases clearing double in the eighth. 
leads to some more runs. Padres win this one 5-2. Game number four is going to be tomorrow. It's going to be a good one. Make sure you don't miss it. Player of the game, Corey Lupke. He needed to be big, and he was. And the Padres live another day. So your final score here from Petco Park, Padres 5, Nationals 2, Game 4 coming tomorrow. Have a good night, folks.